Beautiful touch. It's been so impressive, actually. It was certainly worth waiting for. Well, he's very unlucky with the kiss and the, the reds that he's not actually out on a colour, but wonderful pot from Trump. One. Well, you saw a wonderful angle of Barry Hawkins's piston like cue action, dead straight. It was a gun barrel and had to be. And that was such a tough shot into these middle pockets, which are probably the tightest pockets on the table. From Barry Hawkins' perspective, it 27. wasn't that difficult a safety shot. Just needed to. The cue ball was very slow in his pace, and once you leave, likes the Trump or any of these top players, and there's another wonderful shot. And she leaves them with a hand on the table in around the bulk area. More often than not, they're going to knock in a long ball. Oh, we're looking right down the line. And he's got to go pretty close to the blue with the cue ball. Yeah, well played. Good shot. One. Just about on it, he's okay. But once again, these middle pockets are so tight. He's so accurate and he's got to play it with pace. Oh, what a 25. shot. What a shot. Nothing will beat last night, that positional shot to get on the last red, but that was the best shot of the match so far. And in terms of this frame, it could easily be the most consequential. He's bang in again. Oh, it's just so good. 69. He's just playing with that sort of air of confidence, Phil. And that's a man who's, of course, been so successful already this season. Another <laughs> tremendous shot. Cue par. So huge frame in the context of this match. But already a half a chance. The man in form. Yeah. One. Just so good at that particular shot. Missing the black and the reds back down towards a ball colour. Should Trump have a go with this red here? There's plenty of value in it. If it goes in, he may refuse it. No, he's gone for it. And there was value in it with the black over the corner pocket. What a pop. At that pace. Oh, that's just wonderful. Once again, hand on the table for Trump. He doesn't miss many of One. those. You've got to be so good with your cue ball and playing safety shots against this man. If he gets his hand on the table and the ball is there to be potted, more often than not, he gets it. One. <coughs> it was a shot to nothing, but you could, there wasn't much room to get through there. We know he knocks these in, but if he doesn't knock this in, then it, it may be that uh, Barry Hawkins gets his chance.
one. The thing is, he is knocking him in. Look at that for a shot. That's 12 out of 13 from long range tonight. And all those long pots I've noticed, David, they're kind of, they're not even making a sound as they go in. They're so far into the middle of the pocket, not hitting the jaw or anything. as well and uh, I think he saw the plant the One. two reds had enough distance between them there it is again One. The beauty part, that was as well cued as all of the the trump pots early. Look at that cue ball, it stopped absolutely dead. Good stuff. It's an unorthodox break, this. It's a break where he's never really been in total control, but he's engineered a few positional shots to keep the break going. Hours playing time. I'm sure at 5 0, Judd Trump and his fans are hoping it'll be over by now. Look at that, though. One. Middle of the pocket. Beautiful. Oh, well, there you know why Barry was unhappy with his break off because it didn't seem too bad. Beautiful pop there. Terrific long red that plays. I think with a degree of confidence that he would pot it, the cue ball hasn't made it the bolt line, which in this instance would be in his favour. The angle has taken the cue ball into the bulk area. You'll see it as a almost a free shot to get the match one. That free shot probably put him in the final. 34. Yeah, it's not quite done, but perhaps a certain degree of relief that he's at the snooker's required stage at least.